All right, this is one other method to get your bearings to show you which way is north in the northern hemisphere if you are out in a normal, uh, fairly open area on fairly flat ground you take a, st a stick and put the ground perpendicular to the ground about 90 degrees from the ground straight up as possible straight up and down it can be about two foot to three foot tall you'll get a shadow in the morning like so it is about I don't know 9.30 or 10 o'clock right now in the morning So what I'll do at the end of the shadow is place a pine cone at the end of that shadow. And then I know a lot of places, uh, a lot of people will tell you wait 15 minutes or 30 minutes to do this. But I would wait an hour to two hours to get a good, accurate uh, reading. So what I'll do is come back in maybe two hours. It might be a little bit longer. doesn't matter. But then I'll show you uh, how to complete this task and give you a good bearing on which way is north, south, east, and west. All right, so we're back here at our pole. It's been almost two hours. So if you noticed before, our shadow was really long. And the tip of it came out to here. I want to mark the tip of it at that angle. And now the sun is higher, so now the shadow is shorter. And there's the tip of the shadow. So we're going to grab a stick. I want to put this stick. From that tip right there to the tip of this shadow right there okay that is east and west and if we put our heel of our left foot and we face this direction where the shadow's going. Okay, you see my shadow's doing the same thing. If I put my left heel against that shadow spot, that was two hours ago, and my right heel against that one, that shadow spot, right between my legs here going this direction is north almost directly north so that's how the shadow stick method works in another couple hours this shadow will be coming over here and it'll be the same from that spot to this spot it'll be a little bit longer but it'll be the same uh, east and west direction with the stick and if I put my left foot my left heel on that shadow and then my right heel on this shadow in two hours I'll be pointing north again and of course, as soon as this, the sun gets almost directly above us, this shadow would be pointing directly north anyway. Anything that's perpendicular to the ground on flat ground, level ground, will be almost directly north because we're in the northern hemisphere. The sun's always to our south. Eagle John, there's one more way to find your way out of the woods.